Welcome back everybody. So today we're going to have the next tasting of my base porter. Uh, this is with Crystal 40 and uh, chocolate wheat malt. 2.5 is when this was bottled, 2.5.21, uh, 5.12% ABV. More in lines of what I'm looking for in a porter. Uh, I have done a couple other ones today, which were, I think one was in the realm of where I wanted, and the other one was almost 6%. Let's see the hiss. Okay, hiss. A little smoke out of there. So I'm calling this a base porter. Oh, we're going over. Um, I call this a base porter, and of course I grab a smaller glass, uh, just because it only has one malt, one adjunct malt, let's say that. So it, it's either, or all of them either have Crystal 40 or Crystal 60, so when I add, you know, the chocolate malt or the coffee malt, or in this case, the chocolate wheat malt, that's what I'm calling the base, because one of these has to be a base for it. So on this version, head is dying down pretty quickly. What bubbles I do have is like a light tan color in there. It almost looks like pop. So this should, huh? Eh, color looks good. You guys are seeing it a little darker than I am. Yeah, pop, a dark pop color, uh, dark brown, uh, red hue in there. We'll see if this, oh, it's going all over the place. There you go. Yeah, you guys are definitely seeing it like a stout. But yeah, good color. Let's go ahead and smell. I, I don't know if it's because I said chocolate wheat. I'm getting a light chocolate wheat. It kind of has that smell like you would get in a wheat beer. Not as the main ingredient at wheat, but it does, it seems like that chocolate wheat does come through. Very, very light, but it overpowers that roasted malt. Now, the roasted malt in here is chocolate wheat, but usually what you would get from the color, because the only dark malt this has is chocolate wheat, so that's done all the coloring. So you would think you would get some roasted notes, which they're there, but I'm not looking at it because I know this is a, a, a porter, and it should have it, and it's just not sticking out like big time, let's say, if that makes any sense. Yeah, a little weediness in there. I don't believe I got that before. It does kind of smell a little watered down, but for 5.12%, that's kind of what I'm looking for. Let's go ahead and taste. Malt, a little roasted malt in there, a little wheat, you could say coffee and chocolate, but it's not like it stands out. This, it kind of seems like it's bland for a porter, like because it, it, it almost tastes watered down because there's no other flavors or there's nothing else there to draw out like a roasted malt or a coffee or a chocolate that it's just like plain. Like you can tell, you can tell you're drinking a darker beer but nothing where I want to be. Like, I would be embarrassed to serve this at a bar. It's drinkable, very drinkable, but yeah, there. this is not the base I wanted. So, yeah, hey, that's why we're making these. I'm gonna try the 60L version here too. So, yeah, if you enjoyed this, check some more out over here, and until next time, happy brewing.